Where are those two good-for-nothing loafers? Sherman? Ronald? Uh. Morning, Morning, Mr. Mr. Titus. Titus! Sherman and Ronald, your two most irreplaceable employees at your service, sir! Enough with the chit-chat. Don't you two know what today is? Oh, no! It's my birthday! I forgot my birthday! Relax, Ronald. It's not your birthday. That was yesterday. Today is out of the ordinary day. The one day in the whole year where we get to choose our most favorite out of the ordinary job to do. Followed by a couple of root beer floats. It's wallpaper day. But, but, but wallpapering is the hardest job since the invention of jobs. And that's why I'm leaving this very important task to my two most irreplaceable employees. Who just might find themselves replaceable if they don't get to wallpapering. Wallpaper? Who does Mr. Titus think we are anyway? Why, I have half a mind to tell him a thing or two. The next time I see that Titus, I'm gonna look him right between the... You two weren't talking about me, were ya? Ah! No, sir! Never, sir! Wouldn't cross our minds, sir! Well then, pitta patter, let's get at her! This wallpaper isn't gonna hang itself! Yes, yes sir! sir! Well, hey, that doesn't look so bad. Maybe this will be a piece of cake after all. Looks more like the whole cake to me. Whoa! So much for out of the ordinary day. Chin up, Ronald. Look, half the work is already done. Huh? What is it? You look as though you've seen something out of the ordinary hidden behind this wallpaper. It's a door. <laughs> a door? Yep. Dinger! There is a mysterious door hidden behind this wallpaper. Custodio Engineer. Engineer? Oh, boy. I love trains. No, silly. Custodial Engineer is just fancy talk for janitor. So no trains, then? No. But it is. Out of the ordinary. Let's check it out. <laughs> Ooh. Huh? huh? It's just a boring old closet. Well, nothing out of the ordinary here. Yep, same old, same old. Well, where are those two knuckleheads up to this time? They found an old broom closet. That's perfect. I'll lock him in there. They'll run out of air and... <laughs> Bingo! We got Sherman's ninth life! It's foolproof! Hold up! There's one thing we've learned. Proof is no match for these two fools. Let me take a peek. Whoa! What's that up there? Oh, fooey. Just a dusty old mug. World's greatest janitor. <gasps> Tell the boys to start packing. Pride's got this one in the bag. Woohoo! We're off to the big litter box in the sky. Sir, you okay, buddy? You look like you saw a go oh, oh, host. Hey, snap out of it. Oh no, what am I gonna do, Ronald? Mugs don't lie, Sherman. And whoever owns this mug is the world's <gasps> best <gasps> janitor. <gasps> it's all coming back to me now. The legend, that is. The legend? What legend? Uh, the legend of... Sweepy Hollow. Sweepy Hollow? Yes, Sweepy Hollow, the um best Janitor to ever work in this hotel. What if Sweepy comes back to reclaim his janitorial duties? Mr. Titus will replace me for sure. That's right. And there's only one thing you can do. What? What? A thousand times! What? You've got to work harder than you've ever worked. Be better than Sweepy ever was. Prove that you, Sherman, are the world's best janitor. I can do that!
Legend has it, Sweepy was the only janitor able to withstand the light from Mr. Lazard's ginormous Zillowat light bulb. You change that bulb, and Mr. Titus may let you keep your job. Change a light bulb? <laughs> I can do that. Sure looks cold in there. And dark. But if Sweepy could do it, so can I. Yes! <gasps> Mr. Lazard? Is that you? <gasps> Phew. I'll have your new light bulb installed in a jiffy! <laughs> well, that's that! What's up, Ron? Ice tea? Legend has it. Sweepy was the best window cleaner Mr. Titus had ever laid eyes on. Clean windows? I can do that. Sure you can, but you have to outclean Sweepy to impress Mr. Titus. And that's why you're gonna clean the windows in Mr. Fish's room. It's all windows! <laughs> okay, I'm going in. But first, some light calisthenics. <laughs> Well, that sounded deadly. <laughs> yes! Eight seconds! Let's see Sweepy Top that. Legend has it, Sweepy laundered all the linens for the entire building. Up with that! Oh. I can do that. <laughs> Finally! Sherman's ninth life is ours! Da -da -da -da. Sa -sa -sa -sa. <gasps> Curdling screams! Nothing like a good scream to assist in the ancient art of shrieking towel origami. <gasps> <Yeah! laughs> Ta-da! Kanpeiki. That's Japanese for perfection. <laughs> But you did it. You outswept Sweepy. And you did it with such... Ken Peaky. <laughs> Domo arigato. There's a couple of root beer floats waiting for you two when you're done. So hurry up! Done? Oh no, Ronald! We got so swept up with the legend of Sweepy that we forgot about the hardest job of all! Wallpaper. For shame, Sherman. Sweepy would never have let a job go undone. Guess you don't have what it takes. Don't worry. I'm sure Sweepy will finish up the wallpaper for you. No! I can do that! Ah! 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 
a bit tired, so I sleepy me must. Chai of chai. This is it. And touchdown. Wait a second. I spy with my little eye a loose corner. Huh? No, it's perfectly fine. Very funny, Ronald. If there's one thing I've learned today, it's to take pride in my work. Now I gotta start all over. Um, Jinger! Another hidden door! World's best chef. World's best golfer? Well, what do you know? Sweepy wasn't the world's best janitor. He was just a guy who collected world's best everything mugs. <laughs> Here's a mug for you! World's best pal. <laughs> Let's go unpack our bags, boys. Hey! What do you say we go get ourselves those root beer floats? I knew it was my birthday! <laughs> <laughs>